tutamkaribisha mgeni wetu kwa jina Bosi Bori. Dada huyu ameweza kuwa katika mitandao vyombo vya jamii, uh, mitandao ya kijamii samani kwa wiki moja sasa hivi kutoka Ijumaa iliyopita kila unaangalia trending Bosi Bori is trending. Are you wondering why is this girl trending Bosi Bori? Karibu sana. Asante sana. Karibu sana kwenye kipindi. Asante. Unaitwa nani jina kamili? Naitwa Neema Bosibori. Neema Bosibori. Una umri gani? Nina umri 20 years. Una miaka 20. Mm. Why are you trending? Kwa mtu ambaye sasa hivi anasikiliza kipindi na shindo tu. Ai, huyu ni nani? Oh, I'm trending because uh, there's a picture of me mm. that uh, I was taken when I was given a scholarship to the Stepper Series. Mm -hmm. Yeah, which has no makeup. Mm. And uh, my profile has makeup and filters, mm. and uh, they are cropped together. Okay. And there's a comparison that this can't be the same person or okay. something like they don't look alike. Kwa hivyo trending ilianza wakati ambapo ulipata scholarship. Kwa hivyo scholarship ya kufanya nini? Ya shule? Yeah, yeah, ya shule. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Nilipata last year, okay. but the image imeletwa kutoka the last year, mm -hmm. imeletwa this year. Okay. Yeah. Kwa hivyo ni kitu mbacho kilifanyika mwaka jana. Yeah. So yeah. someone just dug into your profile, yeah. alafu wakachukua ile picha, kaleta, uh, akaweza kulinganisha. Yeah. Current uh, status yako, yeah. ambao po uleweka makeup, uleweka mm -hmm. filters kwenye mitendao. Yeah. So, uh, so, she, um, Nimeona umeweza kuwa na back and forth kwenye mitandao pia. Wa once upon a time uh, uliweza kusema kwamba ulikuwa unatafuta kazi ya jira yoyote yeah. na ukaweza kupata nafasi mwanamume ambaye hana mke yeah. ana mtoto wa umri miaka saba, aliweza kuchukua na kufanya kama mfanye kazi. Ilikuwa ni? Nilikuwa natafuta mahali pa kukaa juu. Ni mimi ni mwanafunzi na nilikuwa na juu pia karo. Wazazi mm -hmm. wako kwa people sibori wako wako but hawajiwezi mama na baba Hai, um, wako wapi kisi okay wewe ni mtoto wangapi kwa familia wanne okay ndugu mm -hmm. zako wakubwa kwa wapi ndugu zangu wakubwa dadangu mkubwa kwa Nairobi mm -hmm. anafanya kazi gani ni mwana biashara pia mhm mm yeah. ana nyumba yake ama bado hajaolewa bado hajaolewa okay ya yeah. uh... kakaangu ni mwanafunzi dadangu pia ni mwanafunzi mm -hmm. wao ndio wakubwa kombe langu mko wangapi kwenu sita watoto sita so wazazi bado wako kule kisi yeah. nyumbani. Yeah. So ulikuja Nairobi mwaka gani na nani alikuleta Nairobi? Nilikuja Nairobi 2017. Mhm. Mm nilikuja juu ya masomo. I was placed at Management University of Africa. Mm -hmm. So nilikuja kusoma, nililetwa na dadangu. Huyu ambaye anafanya biashara, hapana, mwenye ni mwanafunzi. Mhm. Mm ya. Yeah. Dadako wa mwanafunzi anakuletaje? Alikuwa anasoma Technical University of Kenya. Okay. Ya yeah, na alikuwa anaishi na nani? Hostel. Okay. Hostel. Mm -hmm. Na mimi nilikuwa placed at Management University of Africa. Mm -hmm. So ndio alinileta ni cop like nipate place ya kukaa mm -hmm. na vile nitaji sustain kwenda shule. So dada yako analipiwa na nani karo yake ya shule, college? Alikuwa na help. Okay. Ya yeah, yeah, alifanikiwa kupewa help. Okay. Ya yeah, na she graduate. So ulipokuja ulishi wapi? Nilishi kwa dadangu kwa hostel. Ah uh ah. -uh. Dada yako yupo leo fanya biashara. Mwenye ako campus. Okay. Yeah. Alikuwa memaliza campus at the yeah, time. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. you are staying at her place. Yeah, yeah. So inakuwaji ulikuwa desperate sana kama tayari unamalazi, unamutu yeah. mali ya naza kusaidia na yeah. mali makao. Yeah. Ilikuwaji ukaingia katika mtandao yeah. na kusewa kwamba unatafuta kazi yoyote yeah. ya nyumba na kuenda kuishi na mwanamme ambaye hana mke. Ilikuwaji. Dadangu ali graduate mm -hmm. na akapata internship pa hali. Na internship zingine hawalipi, so hakuwa anajiweza pia. So nilikuwa kama burden kwake. So ndio nikaenda mtandaoni, nikandika message kama neza pata, mtu anataka mfanyi kazi, angalau nipate mwalazi. Mm -hmm. Ya, yeah, ndio siku fanikiwa, lakini nikapata hustle. Nika, nika pata hustle, nika pata pesa kidogo, nika jilipia pa hali mimi mwenye hali mwenye. Kuli hustle wapi? Nilikuwa nafanya marketing. Nilikuwa na uza, nilikuwa na uza credit card. Mm -hmm. Credit, airtime, on commission. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Did you ever go to that house in South Bay kwenye kufanya kazi no. yumba? No. Okay. No. No. Kuku wa yenda? Siku wa yenda. Okay. Manaki wajua kuna vitu vingi mm. vungu kwa mtandao, sasa wezi kuelewa ukweli ni upi ukweli si uh, yani mivu na bechi okay 
imekuwaje kwa kwa wewe baada ya kuweza kuwa trolled kwenye mtandao kuanzia Ijumaa in fact Ijumaa imeona mwisho umeweza kutrend ni Jumatano yeah. how has it been yeah. for you imekuwa imekuwa tough i've uh, undergone counseling and i'm still undergoing counseling imekuwa vigumu hadi nilitoka mtandaoni kwa muda mchache kupata counseling but sasa hivi nani nakupatia ushauri niko nilipeleka kwa professional counselor na nani nilikupeleka ni organization fulani mm. okay yeah, waliweza kuchukua ya yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, chukua mm-hmm. for counseling mm-hmm. ya yeah, ndo nilipata counseling since nilikuwa chini sana mm. na i think since then niko better mm. Mm. okay ya yeah, but nimekuwa vigumu mm. sana kupata masimu unapigiwa pana pale mm kutoka nyumbani umeonekana pa hali hizo picha mbili na meme saro all but all over mm. Mm. okay how you feeling sahi sahi mm. na jihisi afadhali mm-hmm. afadhali na wakati wala wakati umeamka mm. uh, unaona hashtag bossy boy okay siko si niliadvisiwa mm. nisi access my social media no, for some time the, the t- the time where when you could access your social yeah. media yeah. unamka unaona you are trending bossy boy and everyone is saying this everyone is saying that ili kufanya ulisikiaje ili ni drain sana ili ni drain sana ili ni drain sana hadi wakati mwingine nilikuwa na shindwa kutoka kwa mtana ju kuangalia the messages what people are saying na hakuna chenye unaweza kufanya ju kila mtu ako na opinion yake kunihusu sa ilikuwa vigumu sana kwa hizo messages na ili ni drain sana okay niko naye bossy bori ndani ya studio leo akiweza kutusimulia story yake kwa kweli ameweza kupata backlash kwenye mtandao anasema kwamba unajua jinsi ambavyo umeweza kuwa na meme fulani eh yeah. um, vitu kwa ground ni different kwamba anasema aliweza kupata scholarship kutoka kwa women rep Esther uh, Pasari mwaka uliopita na sasa hivi amebadilika kidogo ana hela uh, sihaba anajipaka makeup na ana upload photos kwenye mitandao kidogo anaweka filters hicho ndio kitu ambacho kiliweza kumfanya aka trend wow umri wa 20 na kwa ni dada yako mdogo naweza kuwa ni mtoto wako atakuwa anatusimulia uh, mengi zaidi baadaye kwenye kipindi uh, maana kuna mengi ambayo tunaweza kujadiliana 22494 hapo lakini una swali kwa kibosi bori 02044 ikiwa nambari yangu ya simu kwa sasa tunakujulisha tu ya kwamba unaweza kufurahia mlo unaopenda bila wasiwasi tumia new ino antacid tablet kupambana haraka na kutuliza kiungulia na kufura tumbo new ino calcium antacid tablet zinapatikana sasa kwa duka lililoko karibu nawe shala mwana karibu yangu bosi bori ambaye kwa kweli ameweza kupata kitu kwa Kiingereza unaita cyber bullying ameweza kuwa trolls for the last one week uh, kwa sababu ya picha ambazo ameweza kuweka katika mitandao na bosi bori sasa hivi tuliweza mimi niliweza kuona kitu fulani uh, uliweza kutweet safari moja ukizungumzia kuhusu msanii wa vijana tu atimia darati <laughs> Steve Simple Boy ilikuwa kwa ni yako ama your account was hacked ilifanya. Wewe ulikuwa umetweet eh? Uh, Ukisemaje? Nilisema I got kwani ulikuwa kwa foundation. Yeah. Yeah. Alafu nikaona jibu uh, bosi bori uh, cheza chini talk to the future. <laughs> <laughs> But that was funny. <laughs> that was funny so so really. Um ilikuwa kwa ni uh, Stevo ama ilikuwa kwa ni a parody account a uh, ile kwa kwa ni parody account ya simple boy okay. the real account ya oh, mm. Steve simple boy mm-hmm. yeah okay hapo wale walikuwa wamesema kwamba unaweza kupata scholarship kutoka kwa women rep Esther Pasaris yeah. ili kuaje maana kwa unajua ni watu wengi wanatafuta uh, scholarships mbona kwa kwa imekuwa ni rahisi sana umekuja tu Nairobi yani mambo yanakuwa ndio vizuri haraka ili kuaje at first siku expect kabisa iko kwa my expectations ningepata hiyo scholarship mm-hmm. I think pia ilikuwa favor ju I went to social media mm-hmm. specifically Twitter nika tweet on a, on a just a normal day nika tweet uh, nilikuwa chini sana mm-hmm. na sikuwa 
naweza kulipa karo na siku nimefanya mtihani wangu wa the previous semester mm-hmm. juu siku nimemaliza karo so ndio nikaamua niende tu mtandaoni niandike chini kilikuwa kwa akili yangu na apparently ika blow up na mm-hmm. ika I think ika touch a star passaris mm-hmm. ndio come to work and give a scholarship okay mpaka kumaliza shule yeah. okay so kuna swali kuna mtu hapa kwa mtandao ameweza kuwa mkali zaidi um, anasema oh okay mambo mengi anaitwa Moses Okoth anasemaje nikimnukuu tu nikisoma message yake ya kwanza anasema um mbona mnanipotelea jamani anasema kwamba you are friends with the governor how true is that na umeweza kwa, umeweza pia wewe kubuli watu kwenye mitandao. So right now ni kama anasema kama uh, you know what they say about kama. Unayepe kusema kwa mitandao ni yes, sijaweza yes. kubuli yeyote. Mm. Sija first uh, niki make it clear sija bully yeyote and uh, probably the fan imeenda ni ku give banter mm. just a banter. Okay. Sija bully yeyote. Okay. Yeah. Uh, naona uh, niki niki kunukutu kwa tweet yako ukisema I'm sorry sharing my mind is wrong sorry I'm a millionaire looking for mercy I'm sorry I eat at stairs and can't pay rent I'm sorry I'm sorry it's Twitter for iPhone I'm um I'm a scam I'm sorry that I've conned and stole from you all I'm sorry is the victim uh that is all you see what did you mean by this tweet your tweet ni akitambo kwanza okay at some point 2019 yeah yeah, yeah. january hapo mm-hmm. lakini unajua vitu vyako vyote sasa hivi vinatolewa yeah, kwa yeah, yeah. Mm. yeah. oh first your account ni lilos and it's a tweet mm. i was trolled before i was trolled for i got the scholarship mm. and uh, after that uh, there were images of me eating at tears mm just uh, images scissors on instagram and people were bringing it back to the tl mm-hmm. trying to kuonyesha ni kama anaishi maisha mazuri na nataka kusaidiwa mm. so nili feel bad sana ndio nikanikanga your tweet mm-hmm. yeah okay yeah. this is my only concern i think you've been you've been bullied um eh say la say mbona sikueli swali lako uh anyway sielewi swali lake lakini kuna mtu anauliza uh, where do you see yourself in the next few years and what are you good at as bossibori Okay in the next five years mm. I'm probably seeing myself I've always wanted to own a company my own so mm. I really hope mm. I really hope whatever I'm working on right now mm. helps me out to work out to the goal that I have and uh, Kiswahili tafadhali. Mm. Focus. <laughs> Turudi kwa class you're still 20. Mm. Kiswahili najua unakumbuka. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. So miaka tatu, miaka tano mm. inayokuja na najiona najiona kama najiona ni ni own company yangu. Mm. Yondo imekuwa ndoto yangu kwa muda mrefu and uh, na I'm working towards it. Okay. Yeah. Sasa hivi unasema uko na una una bado unaendelea na masomo. Uko mm-hmm. what year? I'm uh, I completed my third year. I'm mm-hmm. joining fourth year. Okay. Ah uh, ni kusoma tu scholarship umepata. Yeah. Wazazi wako unasema wajiwezi. Yeah. So uko wapi sasa hivi na nani anaku unajimudu vipi kimaisha? You know your shelter, yeah. basic needs tu za kawaida. Yeah. 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 So najimudu nafanya ama ni influencer. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Where? So, ama Twitter influencer specifically. Okay. So unaweza kuuza brands kama ngapi kwa jumla usizitaje kwa majina? More than 20. Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Wow. I've worked with more than 20. Okay. Yeah. So hapo ndio natoa napata chai kate. Okay. Ndio na jikumu kwenda shule. Okay. But you know influencing is not consistent. Yeah, yeah. So how have you managed wakati ambapo uh, kazi ya influencing haipo? Mm-hmm. How are you surviving? It's a it's influencing mm. side hustle nimekuwa nikifanya sales marketing mm. na nauza commodities uh, on profit kama gani nime airtel that's okay. what I've done that's okay. what I do okay sides hii airtel unauza wapi nina supply during, during holiday okay. i supply to shops mm-hmm. 
then uh, na na nikirudi kwa the supplier mwenye ananipea ni supply mm -hmm. ananilipa with commission okay yeah safi Una swali kwa kibosi bora unaweza kuwasiliana nami 22494 nambari yangu SMS 02044457975 Niko naye bosi bora tukimalizia kipindi sasa hivi bosi bora nikija tu kwako nikuulize ah uh, maana niweza kuona tweet yako um, na ni kama kidogo unaamini kwamba mwanamke yoyote ambaye ni mweupe basi ni mrembo zaidi you have issues na rangi yako we mwenyewe do you believe in yourself Do you believe that black is also beautiful? Not even also black is beautiful. Nina kwa na esteem issues, self esteem issues uh yeah, but sasa hivi amuma I believe black is beautiful. I believe black is beautiful. Okay. Kwa nini umekuwa na self esteem issues? Nini nimechangia? Toka utotoni nimepata nimepata ku blush blush backlash about my skin color. Mm. So unapata kwa nini mtotoni ulikuwa unasomea wapi mtotoni wako? Nimesoma Nyanza. Nyanza. But Nyanza all the girls are dark almost. So kwa nini why is your color different from theirs? In fact, honestly, so then your chocolate. So kwa nini why you? Sijui kwa nini mimi kwa sababu nikiwa mtoto hadi kuna kuna wakati mwalimu wangu ale niambia maneno ambayo si mazuri kuhusu rangi yangu sasa ukapata nikapata esteem self esteem yangu mm -hmm. inashuka mm -hmm. inashuka so ndio nime nime grow up mwalimu alikwambia nini akuniambia maneno mazuri alikwambia nini kuhusu rangi yangu alikwambia nini maneno ni ya kale <laughs> nilikuwa mdogo mm -hmm. nilikuwa nilikuwa na class for mm -hmm. na tulikuwa tunafanya kazi shuleni mm -hmm. hapa na pale nika tulikuwa tumetumwa kubeba matofali mm -hmm. ya kujenga shule mm -hmm. na nilipoenda kuchukua akaniambia akaniambia wewe ume, umeficha miaka kwenye magoti mm -hmm. ka wo Okay. Mm. Okay. Mm. So kutoka hapo unasema ili imeweza kuathiri sana self esteem yako. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Ushawahi di bleach? Sitaki bleach. Do you will you ever bleach yourself to badilish rangi yako wakati wote? Sidhani nitabadilish rangi yangu. Okay. Yeah. You're happy with yourself. Yeah. Right I'm now you are above that, yeah. eh? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Una swali kwake 22494 number yangu SMS. Um Uh, asema daktari Ezra Nduso MD ambia bosi bora ajikubali kwanza very important mimi niko na sura personal na siringi uh, kindly ask bosi bora kutoka Lenoi Emmanuel whether she owned an iPhone at the time she was seeking for help uh, Twitter indicated uh, Twitter for iPhone how is it possible did she own an iPhone at the time yeah i i owned an iPhone and i still own the same iPhone But was it boring? You know, sikuelewi kidogo. In one breath una unahangaika au una karo shule. Uh uko hapa, you know, looking for help. iPhone is not two shillings. One minute hauna kabisa, the next minute unapata iPhone. How do you afford such a life? Unawezaje kumiliki vitu vya bei gali namna hii wakati ambapo unalia kwamba jamani nipelekeni shule sina mahali pa kuketi uko tayari kufanya mpaka kazi ya nyumba the next minute unapata iPhone vipi nime own your iPhone kutoka kitambo nimekuwa nayo kitambo ni wakati gani wakati ambapo ulikuwa unatafuta kazi ya nyumba before ni join campus mm -hmm. nikiwa na hustle nikifanya nilikuwa nafanya sales mm -hmm. nilikuwa najitafutia mm -hmm before nipoteze shosho yangu so before uh, you get money but yeah. badala ya kuenroll shule you first thing buy an iphone yeah i i bought the iphone before i joined campus and, and at the time sponsored so. and at the time ulikuwa yeah. unatafuta shule na karo ya shule so priority yeah. yako ni gani kununua yeah. iphone au kulipa karo ya shule nilikuwa nimelipa karo yangu ya shule okay. mwaka wa kwanza nililipa yote ni mwenyewe mm na nilikuwa stable mm. but sasa 
nili run short hapo katikati wakati visanga zilini zilini kujia mashida zikakuja pamoja mm. i was stable before mm. si ku join campus nika ask for help i used to sustain myself before that mm. ndio hapo katikati nika nikapatwa na shida mm. i used even to pay my rent before that mm. before that but during my second year mm. nikapata shida hata singeza kulipa hiyo rent na nilikuwa ndio na hiyo iphone lakini ningeuza pesa ngapi okay hapo wale umesema kwamba umeweza kuwa trolled mara tatu yeah why first nili troliwa juu ya kuishi maisha nzuri mm. kuishi maisha nzuri na si kwa ni maisha maisha mazuri ama ni maisha mazuri kwa mabano maisha mazuri as people see it mm. as people see it in the outside lakini kwa ground kwa ground ni <laughs> different <laughs> so okay so, ndio nilikuwa trolled mm. na mara ya pili na watu lidweje maisha yako ya yeah, yani vitu kwa ground na the real bossy boy it's my instagram okay it's my instagram unaenda mahali pazuri unapiga picha mm. then once they bring it on the other side it's a conclusion i'm living a good life mm. and it's just a picture mm. like any other person can post on the instagram mm. but you see you have to be consistent yeah. eh? you cannot in one minute you're whining and dining yeah. and after the second minute unatafuta kazi hata ya nyumba yeah. so kidogo ina contradict uh, who are these two people yeah yeah, yeah. okay now his images pia ni as sometime back mm. see the, the same period okay so mara kwanza ulikuwa troll ulikuwa troll kwa sababu gani kwamba unaishi vizuri yeah okay yeah na anahitaji usaidizi mhm yeah mara ya pili mara ya pili nikakuwa trolled for my looks jinsi naka jinsi mm. sura yangu mm. but you're beautiful yes you are thank you yeah na mara ya tatu mara ya tatu nimekuwa juzi mm. nimetoliwa kuhusu the same same thing in America America mm, mm, yeah my life mm, and uh, ni kama people expect me to be the same person i used to be na i think there's room for improvement and people change i can't i can't i can't be the same person i used to be wakati nilikuwa nahitaji usaidizi i'm progressing i'm moving forward i i yeah okay yeah Trolling sio kitu rahisi by the way you 20 i am um, 37 today for stroll i don't know what i will do okay unawaz una unajua una ukitoka kuwa mtandao anytime soon si mara kini zito ni kuona kila siku na trend and people say when well, you these are people they don't care they know i met you they don't care about you uh-huh. so they will say anything you know uh-huh. unajua ukitoka kuwa kwa mtandao as a person the only quitting as an option. Mm. Uh, yeah. So, ninge prefer ninge prefer I've had a break. I've had a break of social media. Mhm. Nime undergo counseling mm. and uh, I'm just taking some time off, mm. but I don't consider quitting as an option. Okay. I believe it's better. Okay. Yeah. A few gaps missing Instagram is your appearance, Twitter is your personality. Okay? Huyo ni Moses Okoth. Uh, Purity Love anasema tena to stop pate after pate. Ah uh, mwingine naye anasema Saila Simon Jakoyugi anasema the story is contradicting. She wants shared photos of her celebrating her birthday like a queen. Mimi si mwelewi yake. So again, what have you learned? Well, you are again eh, contradicting your lifestyle and the real you. Yeah. Ni kitu gani umeweza kujifunza uh, kupitia makosa yako kwa mitandao? ama vitu ambavyo umefanya kwa mitandao vimekufunza nini Naamini kwa vitu ambazo nimefanya kwenye mitandao vitu ambavyo mimi mwenyewe nimepata ku learn from that ni saying the truth always saying the truth because uh, without without saying the truth there is a lot of information in a contradict mm. and uh, and also about about uh, the party life yenye ambayo umeniambia sasa hivi naza 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 sema wakati huu wakati huu sasa hivi mimi mwenyewe na naji 
na deal with your rent na na to accommodate na and who finances that little flashy lifestyle by the way not flashy lifestyle okay it's, it's not a, flashy lifestyle. it's a fake flashy lifestyle yeah yeah or okay. something or okay stuff. but why do you feel like you need to prove something to the world and that's what the society has placed us mm. need to be yeah yeah so una it's in a certain way that you feel there's something there's something you have to show them yeah 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 so una juta mina juta okay. mina juta I, I regret a lot. Okay. Yeah. What would you change? Given another chance. Given another chance. Job addition. Given another chance. First thing I'd <laughs> not cross anyone's path online. Mm-hmm. Yeah. We cross Ngapi. We cross Ngapi. Other than your Steve. <laughs> okay, I don't know Simple any book. other but okay. me Steve was in for voice so okay. far. So far. I mm. mean at first you get expecting get her that far. Mm. First thing see the cross path them too. And then the second thing I just be me myself, mm. myself. Mm. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So currently uh kwa instagram yako hakuna hakuna yeah. filter kama una post jinsi ulivyo can i ask you something yes sure is it wrong to use makeup no is it wrong to use filters? i have makeup is no it, is it wrong to use filters no then why should i change that okay no because you see you you initially you will say kwamba um will be yourself Yeah. by yourself in a manner kwamba hata zile filters utaweka makeup utaweka na ndio vitu ambavyo unapigwa vita navyo sana kwenye mtandao yeah. so i just wanted to clarify that from you yeah yes. so uh, uh, me what i mean by being myself mm-hmm. i'll just do my thing yeah. if i have to use makeup mm-hmm. i'll still use it okay. if i feel like using filter mm-hmm. i'll still use it it's not a crime to do that but that's still being myself mm-hmm. it doesn't mean nikika bila makeup that's when i'm myself Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Kwa msichana mdogo anakusikiliza ambaye uh, una umri sawa na yeye, unaweza kumshauri kitu gani? A 20 year old yeah. now listening yeah. to you yeah. or 20 less yeah. listening to you right now. Unaweza kumpata ushauri gani? Naweza mwambia with ama without those makeup you're still beautiful. And without those filters you're still beautiful. Don't let anyone compromise your beauty. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Bosi bori ndani ya studio maswali mengi yamekuwa kwa mtandao kule kwa uh, Twitter tu. Safi, thank you very much for coming. All the best. Asante. Uh, unasomea nini by the way? Commerce. Commerce. Okay, ndio mwaka wa mwisho eh. Yeah. Kila la heri my dear. Asante. Okay, ningependa kusalimiana nyumbani kisi. <laughs> <laughs> Ya, yeah, kwa <laughs> salamu kwa wazazi. Uh-huh. Marafiki. Mm. Yeah. Mama Mama ana yuko nini? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alisemaje? Okay, ni my elder sister alimpigia simu akamuelezea mm. mambo yanavyoendelea mm. and she's a very prayerful mom so mm. akasema mm. ataomba tu. Okay. That's all she said. Baba kuiko hai? Yeah. Anasemaje? ya pata feedback yake. Okay. Mama yangu ndio kwa feedback yake. Ina maana kwamba uko karibu mahusiano yako na baba yako karibu ama yako lakini si sana kama mama yangu. Kwa nini? Sika sababu ni mama na kutoka kitangu tumekuwa very close na yeye. Okay. Yeah. Malezi yako imekuwa vipi kwa nini bosi bori? Malezi yangu mm. uh, na wazazi wangu mm. at some point we were very stable, very financially stable. Mm when well, they have paid for on our school fees mm-hmm. high school primary mm-hmm. and then hapo katikati mm-hmm. ndio mashida zilitokea suddenly kwa moja so zika paralyze everything okay. at once ilikuwaje ilikuwa draining to mama ngo alipoteza kazi yake na mama ngo at the same time okay yeah baada ya so, kupoteza kazi ndio maisha kabadilika yeah okay. na we had to start from scratch mm-hmm. from scratch mm-hmm. hata nyumbani Wow. Is that hiyo uh, pengine ndio umeweza kuchangia sana kwa kwa wewe kutojikubali maana kuna wakati fulani yeah. uliishi vizuri maisha kifahari yeah. na sasa hivi maisha imebadilika 
do you still live in that space where once you guys were well off yeah 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 i was used to that like okay. before now it happened within a very short period because from my childhood in the core very from a very good background mm. up to when i was finishing my form for mm. joining campus that period Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Thank you. Anyway, thank you, Monday